Bruh, Timu. Mark your fucking days. This shit gotta be illegal, yo. Money piling, I've been running from the Jakes. Getting hot is when I take it to the face. They done lie, my cousin should have seen a look on Auntie's face. And I wish What's going on, Hype? The fuck back, bro? What the fuck? Space. Personal space. So I pretty much woke up today, bored as fuck. And I think. I'm gonna see what the fuck this Timu shit is about. No, cause for real, everybody been talking about, yo, you gotta order this off Timu. You gotta get some shit off Timu. Timu is the GOAT and all this. I'm about to see really what the fuck going on. So let's go ahead and go on the app, see what the fuck they got, and see how fast it can get here. All right, so let's see what the fuck we can get up off of here. Y'all know me, I'm a fashion guy. I, I like fashion shit. You know what I'm saying? Oh. Hold on, these look like Valabasas. Do I dare? First of all, do they have my side? Wait, hold on. Look away. Y'all don't need to be looking at what side. Matter of fact, cut the camera off. Okay, what else? What else I'm gonna get? I'm only gonna do two things. You know what I'm saying? Cause like, it was this app I used to use called Wish. And that shit went completely left. And I wasted a lot of fucking money. I'm not doing that shit no more. So let me see. I'm going to get these fake ass Rick Owens. Fuck it. Let me see how they turn out. <laughs> let me see what they doing. So I guess now all I got to do is wait for, you know, them to come and drop the shit. UPS, bitch. Hey, the fuck if I put this note on your door. I'm just bullshit. I'm just bullshit. Let me cut this stuff out. There's already a hole right here. I didn't really need this shit, bro. Fuck it. Oh, yeah. Oh, hell yeah. Yo, let's go ahead and get it. Did not. Let's go ahead and get into this shit. All right, you guys. So, we're going to go ahead and get into this. As I stated, Timu is a fucking cheat code now. And, like, I'm looking at this stuff and in complete awe and amazement because I did not think the quality was going to be this high. Now, don't get me wrong. Shit ain't top quality. Okay? Like, come on. If you go on Timu and you see the prices, shit is not going to come out the way you think it's going to come out. But um, enough chit-chat. Let's go ahead and get into, you know, the things that I got. So, like y'all saw... Pre, uh, earlier in the video, I got two things. I got a pair of jeans and I got some uh, shoes. The pair of jeans resemble Valabasas jeans. Um, as y'all know, Valabasas, they come out with one style. They never come back out with it again. Therefore, you snooze, you lose, for real. So uh, I got some Valabasas looking jeans. We're going to see how those turned out. And um, I got some some Dick Owens, some fake ass Rick Owens, some Fick Owens. You know what I'm saying? So we're going to see how they look like. I've already, mind you, I've already just looked over this because I was, I'm anxious. I'm sorry. I already looked over this. And like I said, the quality is crazy. I'm I'm very surprised. So, but, you know, I'm going to stop blubbering and, and, and talking and shit. We're going to get into it. So first thing first, the Valabasas jeans. Now, the quality of these jeans, uh, the the material is very, it's very sturdy. I really like it. It's, um, it's thicker than I thought it was going to be. However, this does not look like the damn picture. As you guys can see. Now, obviously, 
I can, you know, you, you got, if you guys seen my old video of me showing you guys how to distress your jeans, I can make these how I want them to look. You know what I'm saying? Like they gave me a, a, a pretty much a blueprint of how I can use my little drill gun and, and, and just distress the rest of them. And, you know, it does come with the flare and medium distressing at the bottom. So I'm not mad. I'm not mad at these at all. These are still fly. You know, I can wear these as is. You know what I'm saying? Let me open them up a little bit for you. <laughs> Pause. Um, but yeah, these did not come out exactly like the picture, you know, that you guys saw. But I'm not mad at it. I'm not mad at it. I got my money's worth. I feel if so, the material and the design equaled up to the amount of money that I paid for them. I will say that, you know what I'm saying? And if I need to do some further distressing, I will, which I'm probably going to because y'all know me, I'm, a, I'm an artist, I love doing, I just love handiwork, I love doing things with my hand, that's why I created my clothing brand. By the way, if you haven't already, go ahead and hit up blackdivinity.com Go over there and get you some some items, man. Go over there and, 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 and just splurge on yourself this holiday season. You know what I'm saying? Just like how you can order some shit from Timu, you can order some shit from BlackDivinity.com. You know what I'm saying? That's BLKDivinity.com. You know what I'm saying? I'm telling you, my shit over there is the truth. You already know. T-R-O-O-F. The real official official. Facts, you know what I'm saying? So, but enough of that, you know what I'm saying? Let's get into the Ricky Owens. These were pleasantly surprising to me because when I opened the joints, I was like, did they like send me some, some real Rick Owens by accident? Cause I, would, I, 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 I wasn't mad at them. You know what I'm saying? Obviously as I dug deeper into this uh, sneaker, I could tell that, you know, this ain't the real Rick Owen. But damn, I'll be damned if they didn't uh try to get this motherfucker right. Like, you got the zip up, the embellishment, you got the thick laces, the vintage thick laces, the rubber sole, like this is not leather, but it feels like faux leather, you know what I'm saying? And it, I'm just like <sighs> They damn near came close. Like y'all, like, like, don't, like, don't, don't, don't lie to yourself. If a motherfucker just threw these on and you ain't, it, it, if, 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 if a high ranked person in the fashion industry just threw these on, you're not going to think they're not Rick Owens. You, you're not going to think that these are, uh, 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 Tick Owens, Timu Owens. Like you, you're going to think that these are real Rick Owens. You know what I'm saying? Only thing, like like one of the only things that made me say this is a, this is not a real Rick Owen is this shit. I know this is hurting some of you so uh you uh so called sneaker people soul right now, <laughs> but trust me, it's, it's a fake. It's not a real Rick Owen. You know, real Rick Owens don't talk to you like that. You know what I'm saying? So, but yeah, that's one of the things. D structure of the shoe is ass and i'm so mad because that would have made this shoe a lot more interesting i would have been like yo y'all really put time in and and for the price that you charge for them y'all really put time into not only making the shoe look almost like the damn rick owen but the structure of the the shoe is good you know what i'm saying but unfortunately you get what you pay for it, and you know what I'm saying. I, I I highly expected that. You know what I'm saying. I ain't gonna lie though. The price that I paid for these shits, I paid for some Adidas, and that and 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 Adidas structure is way better than this. So I'm just like y'all could have y'all could have took some of that and 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 did something in here to where it would be sturdy. Cause ain't no reason my shit could turn from a Rick Owen to a taco. In like 2.3 seconds like that's that's crazy as hell but i'm gonna open up the the other one i'm gonna let y'all see it together and it 
kind of they kind of did good with the you know they 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 even put them in you know these little bootleg dust bags. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? So this is what they look like together. You know what I'm saying? These 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 real these I ain't, I ain't gonna even lie. These these kind of surprised me. I was like, yo, y'all 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 might be on to some shit, Timu. Y'all motherfuckers, like, come on. Th hold on, thumbnail. Crazy, but it, but like, bro, I'm gonna be honest. These ain't bad. I ain't gonna even hold you. Now, before I get some of you, uh, you motherfuckers coming in here talking shit, <laughs> I love you all, by the way. Um, I do not condone whatsoever anybody buying fakes and selling them as if they were real, okay? I don't, I, don't, I don't condone that shit at all. I got got a couple of times in high school for uh, for some motherfuckers. So, oh yeah, bro, you know, man, I get all the real. I, I work at Foot Locker, and the nigga did work at Foot Locker, but the motherfucker gave me some fake shit, which made me be like, bro, yeah, don't come back to school, bro. I'm sorry, that was violent. I ain't mean to say that, but anyway, um, I don't condone that shit. That's that, that fucks up the sneaker game. Come on, y'all. Come on now. It's fun, like like the sneaker game. The sneaker game already ain't fun no more because these these sneakers is getting high as hell on the prices and subpar ass sneakers. Like the the sneakers don't even look the price it should be. Two hundred dollars for some ugly ass motherfucking sneaker. I don't I don't I don't understand it. You know what I'm saying? And plus y'all so called sneaker people out there is being overthrown. You know what I'm saying? It, it the, the game ain't fun no more. Because motherfuckers want to just resell all the time. They turn something that was fun as a collection, uh, uh, as a collection uh, item or a collector, they turn that shit into a fucking multi-billion dollar business by buying the shit at a retail price and then selling it for you as resale. You know what I'm saying? The fact that you can buy a two hundred dollar sneaker and then resell that bitch at six hundred dollars is insane to me but the it depending on the rarity of the sneaker and the demand of the sneaker i get it you know you got to make your money somehow i don't knock you i just i just think it, it that that resale stuff kind of fucked up the game a little bit you know what i'm saying like and it's because people i, I just feel like because people are being a little bit too greedy like taking a like even if you just even if you just doubling the price, I get it. It's like, hey man, you have to pay double. I had to sit out and, and do all this shit for the sneaker and stuff like that. I get it. I get it. You know what I'm saying? Y'all don't even gotta camp out no more. Y'all motherfuckers got bots. And that 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 that's also fucking up the game. Because when motherfuckers try to hit on on sneakers that that's literally just trying to get the sneaker. Y'all got the bots taking up all the shit, and then now none of the shits are available because y'all got all the sneakers. Now you're going to resell it to me for for triple the fucking price. Get the fuck out of here. Take a $250 sneaker and sell it for, for $780 or $825. Fucking wrong with y'all. But anyway, I just feel like y'all are being a little bit too greedy with that. Hey, is, say if you take a, a two hundred dollars sneaker and sell it for three fifty, or four hundred, if you if you if you really want to, like, hey man, I had to you know do all this to get this sneaker. Okay, I pay you an extra two hundred dollars to get to to get it. You know what I'm saying? Because with taxes for for a two hundred fifty dollars sneaker, with taxes you damn near paying three hundred anyway. So I'm paying you four hundred. You getting some of your money back plus a little bit to, you know, cash in or whatever. Y'all just being greedy. Y'all know y'all being greedy. But anyway, I digress. That ain't none of my business. Anyway, man, I hope y'all enjoyed this video today. I hope y'all enjoyed the review. Um, I got more things coming up like this. Uh, we are on the road to a thousand subscribers, man. And all I can say is big changes, baby. 
big changes once I hit that first thousand. Um, the next step after that is 10,000. So, you know, with that being said, man, y'all run up this video, run up the next video, and y'all, yeah, I, I just want to thank y'all. You know what I'm saying? I, I, I can't stop thanking y'all enough for like everything that y'all did, man. Like, like we really created a community, Hype Space TV. You know, we, 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 we created a community to where we can just do, do us, have fun, you know what I'm saying? Vibe out, talk about things we love, like fashion, do things that we love, like just going out to places, you know what I'm saying? And it's, 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 it's just all a blessing to have, you know, each and every one of y'all. I really, I really fuck with y'all and I really appreciate y'all. And we're going to keep running it up until we reach the top and we ain't going to stop. And even when we get there, it's hype space. We're going out the atmosphere. But anyway, I will see y'all in the next video. I love y'all. And until the next time, ain't nothing but space and opportunity. And I'm out. Money piling, I've been running from the jakes. Getting hot is blunt, I take it to the face. They done lost my cousin, should've seen her look on auntie's face. Man, I wish she did the race. Need this and all.